already done that 10 years ago can he or she be your mentor absolutely yes because they have already done that transition but then you know be clear that you want to learn from them not say and today say just imagine you put yourself in say any industry person's position so the a stranger reaches out to you and tells you give me a job it's like that's not going to happen right if a stranger reaches out to you and says to you please marry me will you do that no so it's as simple as that so you know when you engage with industry people say identify this can be someone from outside your company or within your company as well so you are a sales rep you might see there is a marketing head or a product manager who's friendly with you can you make them your mentor have say structured learning kya re marketing ke job mein hota kya exactly what does marketing involve say today as a sales rep what skills do i need to pick up to move to marketing a mentor can help you with that say if you have any doubts queries who will you go to if you have a dedicated mentor you can easily get that done so you know whenever i speak in any college this is one advice i give everyone say right at your student base so right now your students please find industry mentors and learn from them say so don't expect jobs from them but then you can learn tremendously from them learn how the industry works learn what are the nuances what are the opportunities challenges what skills we should pick up to become a valuable asset so you know right in your student days please do that so you can do that in your personal network as well right so in your personal network relatives friends family you can find someone in the pharma industry you can reach to people through linkedin you can reach out to people who come to your college so don't tell me that okay are it's very difficult to find mentors the answer is no you can easily find mentors and do that in your student days it can tremendously help you so you will be much better prepared when you say start your job than most other people also you know um, mahesh spoke about it i'm just repeating what you spoke you know your career is going to last for like 40 years and you have to continuously learn and when you want to make a transition it becomes all the more important say if you want to transition from sales to marketing please understand that okay what skills apart from of course you're doing a mba you have already learned a lot but don't have the feeling gary whatever there was to learn i have already learned in the mba you know i have done my mba now i know everything don't have that approach so urande sir also spoke about say the importance of ai ml see technology is emerging so you can always enhance yourself once you have a mentor you have a understanding okay what kind of skills you need to pick up keep learning so today you know you can actually go to youtube you can there are so many forums platforms where you can learn for free say on coursera you can do some amazing courses for 2 3 000 rupees which is nothing say you have linkedin learning you have so many other platforms you can do good courses for as cheap as 4 500 rupees so perspective that okay which skills i need to build and continuously keep doing time comes you get a opportunity for an interview say your head office calls you for an interview for a position of a product manager and they ask you a question say apart from your job say you are doing your sales you have good relations you have good communication skills you have good decision knowledge but what extra have you done to say for us to consider you for a product manager position over there this will help if you tell them that okay i have been good in these 10 things but apart from that this is what extra i have done say i have learned digital marketing i have learned analytics i have learned say more about the disease area so the more you present in terms of your learning it will make your case stronger so if you want to be say a product manager this will definitely help you okay now this is one thing i see that i know that say we are all good at communication so if i speak with someone in even i love speaking in marathi and hindi marathi is my mother tongue hindi is something i grew up with in mumbai so you know i love speaking in marathi and hindi of course english is a compulsion so we learned in english medium schools college and of course that's the language that you communicate at work but then you know no matter whether you like it or not you have to sound good at times you might feel hey this is very shallow that okay i might not be very good at english or communication skills or presentation skills it's a necessary evil so say if you are working in sales and marketing you have to have great communication skills so that includes your written skills your say public speaking skills and say there will be times when say as a sales rep as well you have to present in front of your say entire region say 40 50 people at that point of time if you are not good at public speaking no matter how good you are at your job 